I'm News 6 anchor Ginger Gast, and here are your headlines for Friday, May 10th. A man hit and killed by a train. It happened this morning on Lake Lily Drive in Maitland. The investigation caused delays for SunRail today, but authorities have not said whether it was a SunRail train that caused the crash. All trains were back on schedule by 4 this afternoon. Corruption allegations lead to the arrest of Palm Bay's former deputy city manager. A new FDLE report accuses Dave Isnardi and Jose Aguiar of former Palm Bay City Council candidate of trying to extort a current and former city council member. In 2015, the FDLE says undercover sources found the two men had installed secret cameras at a Palm Bay home for the purpose of trying to catch the two council members taking pills and with prostitutes. The FDLE says it is continuing its investigation. A record 75 million tourists visited Central Florida last year while many are still heading to the theme parks. International Drive is capturing a bigger and bigger crowd as it continues to grow and change. Icon Orlando, which is home to the new Star Flyer and the renamed Wheel, has already started construction of new rides. The first, a 400-foot-tall gyro drop, which will spin you going up and drop you as fast as 75 miles per hour. The second, the slingshot, which stands around 50 stories high and catapults people 450 feet in the air. Both of these attractions would be the tallest in the world. Get breaking news, weather, and traffic around the clock on ClickOrlando.com. That's your News 6 update. I'm Ginger Gadsden. Brought to you by OUC. OUC shines brighter. 